Hey there, homeowner. Rich from Solar Microscope here. I help educate homeowners like you so you can look at solar under the microscope and decide if solar is the right fit for you to save money. I personally don't sell solar, so I'm not in the solar industry. I'm in the advertising industry, and I've actually helped over two and a half billion people learn more about solar energy through my simple YouTube ads. So the biggest question people usually have about solar is they're confused about how they can get solar panels for free. Is that true? Or is it just some misleading advertising tactic? So I'm here to tell you the answer to that. The answer is yes, solar is free and no, solar is not free. So wait, what? How is it possible that solar is free and not free at the same time? Well, really the answer to this question is twofold. So number one, it depends on how you obtain solar in the first place. And number two, it really depends on what you mean by the word free. So let's cover the first one first. The question is, is solar free? The answer is, it depends how you get it. So solar panels can be offered a variety of ways. So I've personally had solar for over 10 years and I've experienced solar on two different homes of mine in two distinct ways. Number one, my first house, first house I ever bought, I got solar panels, second year I had the house, through what is known as a PPA. That stands for power, purchase agreement. Sometimes this is called leasing solar, which is the opposite of owning solar, similar to like when you lease a car instead of owning a car. In a power purchase agreement, you don't pay a dime for the solar panels. In that sense, the panels really are truly free. Instead, you agree to pay the company that installed the solar panels on your home a cheaper rate of power. So in my situation, I was paying on average $200 per month on my electric bill at that time on my first house. So my new bill to the solar company after they installed the solar was about $120 per month. And my electric bill was completely reduced. So I didn't have an electric bill anymore, but I didn't own the solar panels. I didn't have to pay for them. I was leasing them in order to save $80 a month. So I was paying $200 a month before, then I paid $120 a month. I saved $80 a month immediately, didn't have to pay anything, just let the solar company install it. And the way that benefits the solar company is that they get the benefits from installing solar, the government incentives, then you're paying them instead of the electric company. So they're they're basically replacing the utility company at that point, but it's a benefit for the homeowner. If the homeowner doesn't want to pay for the solar panels and doesn't want to own them, and just wants to take the benefits of them. Well, you can do that through a power purchase agreement. Um, I didn't have to finance them. I didn't have to pay anything for them. I just experienced immediate savings. So in that sense, solar really is free. It was even easy to sell my first house because the new owner just took over the agreement and we actually sold the house for more money because he liked that the house had solar. Now on my second house, I paid for the solar panels and owned them. So this is a different type of way to obtain solar. So in that sense, solar was not free, but my electric bill was previously about 500 to $700 per month. It seems pretty high, but we have four different air conditioners and a pool, so a lot more energy being consumed. But now I pay about $200 per month for the solar panels. So I'm experiencing between about $200 a month in savings in the winter, up to $500 a month in savings, immediate savings after I got the solar panels. Not bad. And it was also a super simple process. If I ever decide to sell my house in the future, I can get a higher price because the solar panels will now be owned by the new homeowner. But the question, is solar really free, we're really presupposing a different type of question. We're really worried about a different thing. And this is the second point. When most people ask, is solar free? What they're really asking is, do I have to pay for solar before I start seeing the benefits of solar savings? And the answer to that question is no. So in that sense, it kind of is free. So 99% of solar companies offer flexible, low interest financing for the solar panels. So you don't have to come out of pocket at all to get solar. So it's $0 down, literally not a penny out of your pocket has to come out. And once the solar system is turned on, your electric bill can be mostly reduced to nothing. And the payment for the solar panels will be less than what you paid to the utility company. So think about it. If you pay $200 per month to your electric company right now, and your new solar payment is $100 per month, like which is very common for people in like states like California or Hawaii, for instance, you're immediately saving $100 per month without spending a dime. Now, is that free? Well, in one sense, yes, it is. Actually, it's better than free. You're pocketing $100 a month 
you didn't have before. And every month that goes by, you'll save even more because the electric company continues to raise their rates slightly every single month. And right now, at the time this is being recorded, inflation is crazy right now. And some of the highest bills that homeowners experience that are going up are their electric bills. I've seen cases where the electric companies are raising their rates by 50% compared to last year. So if you had a $200 bill last year, your bill in 2023 is gonna be $300 a month. So it's just crazy stuff. And that's the benefit of solar energy. So in that sense, no, solar is not free. You still have to make the $100 per month payment. So in that sense, solar is not completely 100% free. But after a number of years, those payments will be done and you'll save even more. Then you won't have a payment and your energy usage will be totally free because it's produced by the solar panels on your house. So I hope this video helped you understand how in one sense, solar is not free. But in another sense, it really is. It doesn't cost you anything extra. So in that sense, it's free. And actually it's better than free because most homeowners immediately start saving in their pocket in the first month. And if you lease solar, like I said, on my first house, I did, you don't have to pay anything for solar in that situation. And it is hundred percent accurate and not misleading whatsoever to say that the solar is free. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel for more unbiased solar educational content. Like I always say, I don't sell solar, but I've educated so many people through my solar YouTube ads that I can help connect you with a trusted installer who can send you a personalized custom design for your home. If you're open to getting a custom design specifically for your home so you can see how much you can save, then just visit our website at solarmicroscope.com. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and watch some other videos so you can learn more about solar before you decide to get it. Take care.